question, and I'd like you to tell me the answer in the comments. What's one thing that you could do differently in order to help you reach your art goals? The reason I ask this is because I know many of us artists have plans and dreams and goals, be that finding community or earning an income from art or even growing our skills, but we stall and we wonder why we aren't achieving those things. And it's usually because we aren't doing anything different. We are staying on the same path, looking at trickier or more daunting routes, thinking, I don't want to go that way, despite the fact that our desired goals may lie just beyond the trees. You know, being an artist can sometimes feel like a solitary journey, and we often find ourselves gazing at other artists, marvelling at their incredible talent and gifted abilities, and wondering, why am I not there yet? Today, I want to challenge that perspective. I want you to see those artists not as inherently gifted or talented or lucky, but as individuals who've embraced hard work and discipline on their artistic journey. You see, the path to becoming a skilled artist is not paved with innate talent alone. It's about rolling up your sleeves, putting in the hours and pushing yourself to improve every single day. It's about embracing hard work and discipline rather than waiting for some magical muse to bestow its gifts upon you. So how do you get there? It's simple, you need to do something different. And if you've been sitting back hoping your skills will magically grow, it's time to take action, do something different. Seek out lessons or find a mentor who can guide you. Remember, even the most talented artists started as beginners and they invested in their growth and you can too. Now, I know self-doubt is a constant companion on this artistic journey and you may sometimes feel like you're not worthy or your work doesn't measure up. And guess what? You're not alone in this struggle. To overcome self-doubt, find community that can provide you with support and encouragement. Do something different, share your work, share your doubts and share your triumphs with others who understand what you're going through. It's incredible how a little encouragement can go a long way in bolstering your confidence. If you've been going alone, it's time to find a friend who shares your passion and embark on this artistic journey together. Stop going it alone and do something different. Get accountability, and accountability really is a powerful motivator. And speaking of support, I want to tell you about something I've created to help artists just like you. It's called the Inspiration to Creation Collective, and it's designed to provide you with the support, guidance, and accountability you need on your artistic journey. In our Inspiration to Creation Collective, we offer a nurturing community of fellow artists who are dedicated to growth and improvement. We have regular group sessions where you can share our progress, exchange ideas and offer constructive feedback. It's a safe space where you can overcome self-doubt and celebrate your successes together. You can hear about Sandra's success in doing something different by standing outside her comfort zone. Or from Rose, who's always been a part of entrepreneurial memberships, but now finds that the ITCC is so much more for artists to make friends and grow. The ITCC welcomes you and just follow the link in the bio to do something different today by investing in yourself. And there's 50% off your first month too, so what could make that step easier? So my fellow artists, remember this, you do have the potential to achieve the greatness that you've been chasing. But it's not about being born with a gift, it's about nurturing your passion and embracing hard work and seeking growth. Doing something different will help you too, so if you've been going it alone, find a friend. If you've been waiting for your skills to grow, seek lessons or mentorship. And if you doubt your worth, join a community that will lift you up. So I really hope that you spend a little time today thinking about what it is that you can do that is different to help you take that step forward on your artistic journey. And let me know in the comments, I'd love to hear from you. I'm going to leave you alone so that you can enjoy the rest of this process video in peace. I left it kind of long because I think it's a really beautiful process video and I couldn't bear to cut it any shorter than it is. So I really hope you enjoy it. Thank you for watching and remember your journey as an artist is about growth and it's not innate talent. Embrace it, build those skills, work hard and remember you will get there. So let's go ahead and create something beautiful together and I can't wait to see you for the next video. 
Goodbye, guys.